Hi guys, and today I'm going to be talking about The Two Towers by um, J.R.R. Tolkien. This was an extremely good book. I liked it better than the first one. Um, if you did not know, this is the second book in the Lord of the Rings trilogy. Um, the first one's Fellowship of the Ring, the last one's next month of the Return of the King. But this is the middle book. Um, I liked it better than the um, first one. Um, I really enjoyed the perspectives of like... I really enjoyed like how it's not just um, Frodo and Sam because oh, this whole book being about Frodo and Sam would be boring. So we had to it would Gandalf and the rest of the Fellowship and then Frodo and Sam um, bring the ring, which was cool because there was like there was like each book has like two books in it. I'm not sure that it's like in the middle of his book two or something. Yeah, this is book four. It's just like um, this was this was a really good book. Um, this um. I kind of just enjoyed the concept of it. Um, I still think there was way too many songs, like, just, like, the lyrics. I think it does provide lore and, like, world builds, but just, like, the lyrics is kind of um, unnecessary, but maybe for the time, because this was a long time ago. Um, I really enjoy this cover as well. I think this was one of the best covers of the series, and I just like to look at it. Um... The, yeah, I can see it. I like the red on the black. Um, the, but yeah, um, so the pages are confusing on this one. This is what confuses me is, like, the Fellowship of the Ring had normal pages, but this picks up on the same amount of pages. Like, let me find the start of it. Picks up on page 404. So, like, it starts at 404 because that's where the Fellowship of the Ring ended. And Goodreads was super confused because I said, I'm on page 500, and it's going to think I'm done with the book, but I'm not. So, um, yeah, so um, that was just a little confusing for me, and I'm going to have to do that as well with The Return of the King. Because um, Goodreads was a little bit confused. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I think it was more modern than I expected, like, in a modern perspective, um... Like, I thought it would be, like, older, like, just, like, very, like, non-relatable because this came out or way before I, like, I read it. Um, but it was actually very, like, it kind of relates and I can understand it uh, more than I thought. And as for these additions, um, these covers bend super easily. Like, there'll be creases and all that. So, like, every little, like, bang this book takes, it'll soak in, um. But I really love these covers, so I just, I'm sad about that. Um, so I am not reading um, the three books right in front of each other. I read Fellowship of the Ring, and then I read The Tower of Nero, and then I read this book. But now I don't want to read The Return of the King just yet, so I'm going to read Dune by Frank Herbert. Um, I'm really excited for this book. Um, I don't know what to say. I really want to read like classic sci-fi, and this is looks extremely good, and I'm super happy to start um, reading it. Um, so yeah, I don't want to keep you too long, so see you in the next video.